Hi Sagittarius, Narai here again, do a reading for you. All right, I'm not spraying because it's cold on my shoulders. So we're gonna do a reading and see what comes out in the cards. For Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node, please and thank you, Spirit. What messages do we have for Sagittarius, please and thank you? I just saw the, the Knight of Pentacles. I'm thinking there's something you need to be patient about or in regards to. I just saw the, the Nine of Cups, the wish fulfillment. Don't rush thinking that somebody else is going to make you happy. Okay, Spirit, what do we have? Five cards to start, please. Ace of Swords and the Ten of Swords. Two of Pentacles. Two more cards. Ooh! Damn you. The Devil card. Okay. Hmm. So here's what I have. I have the Ace of Swords. The Ace of Swords is about you guys getting an idea, having an epiphany, um, having an aha moment. For me, I say seeing things from a different perspective because of all these stares. Having a realization. I have the Ten of Swords. This is you guys being left to bleed out. This is you being totally betrayed and stabbed in the back. Yeah, the two of pentacles is about you guys prioritizing. Finding balance. And then I have the devil card. It could be a Capricorn, could be a toxic energy, could be over, um, overly obsessing on something doing something in excess, overindulging. What this makes me think is that you're having a realization about a situation that really hurt you. And it could be the fact that there was no balance that you're realizing in your relationships where you're feeling really betrayed and hurt. There is no sense of balance for you because you're not prioritizing yourself first, Sagittarius. You're making the other person a priority, and they're making themselves a priority, too. This is about you guys being protective with your... Protected. Mm, some of you may actually be protected. I don't know why I said that. But being protective of your money and also yourself, uh, your energy, this could have to do with you saving There's a bunch of stuff back there. Like, don't overly spend. This is overindulgence, overly spending. Don't overly spend. Save your money. There's, there's something that you need to save your money for right now. It just hasn't come up yet. I feel like for some of you it's coming. Put money aside for your car. If you're not putting money aside for a car... Uh, for repairs, put money, put some money aside every paycheck for your car. And if you're saying you don't have the money to do that and you're spending money on other leisurely things, sacrifice one of those leisurely things to start putting money aside for your, for your car. I don't know where that came from. But this is in regards to you closing out cycles. Some of you may be traveling. Some of you may be traveling. That might be why, actually, if you're traveling via car, that may be why you need to put the money aside in case something happens. But some of you may be traveling. This could, this could be talking about a person from a distance too. A toxic person from a distance, that might be how you know who it is. Actually, you're going to know who it is because this person kept kept you in a, or 
you stayed in the eight of swords energy behind this person. They didn't keep you anywhere, but you were in the eight of swords energy behind this person. One more card. Oh God, really? Well, this person was, this person is rushing. This person may have rushed. Are there somebody that may be rushing in? This person could be trying to rush back in. They may be an air sign. Oh, this was, no. I don't know which one. Shit. I don't know which one to read first. But there's going to be justice for you. This is just confirmation of somebody that broke your heart. But actually, the justice could be that this person is coming to you because their heart got broken. It is so funny how people think it's okay to treat people like crap until it happens to them. I'm just saying. But that's your reading. All right. Love you. Bye.